everybody, welcome to the Dad Challenge Podcast. My name is Josh. Thanks for joining me today. Before we get started, I want to talk to you about Scentbird. I absolutely love Scentbird. I love this idea. It's such a brilliant way to smell good. Okay, and I love to smell good. The other day I was traveling through an airport and I thought to myself, I don't want to stink for people around me. So hop into the old bathroom. I do this every time I travel, by the way. I always refresh. So I'm usually up super, super duper early, have a shower, get ready to go. By the time I get on my flight, like six hours later, I'm not freshened. Okay, and I want to be fresh. I do want to be that guy in the plane where people are like, Shh. I think one of my favorite fragrance notes is likely something like, I don't know, like that type of like rugged type of cologne, but I'm actually starting to lean more towards different styles as I get more styles from Semper. And it actually does matter what I'm doing, where I'm going with what type of cologne I wear. I was at my child's school the other day doing like volunteer work and I don't want to smell like too crazy, but I want to smell like, hey, this guy actually is clean. Right? So I'll put more of a cleaner scent on if I'm going to hang around other parents and just doing something simple. If I'm going to a job where I'm doing real estate and stuff, I actually want to smell really good. I actually think it's really important meeting real estate agents and meeting clients. I want to smell awesome, but not overpowering. So I'll use something a little bit more subtle. Now, if I want to go with wifey for a big date, we're going to the show, we're going to dinner. I want to smell good. She always smells good. And Scentbird actually is the reason. She loves Scentbird too. So do you agree that what you wear or what you're doing actually matters to the way you smell? And if it is, Scentbird is for you because they send you different colognes every month if you sign up for that deal. And it is a really good deal this month, by the way. Scentbird sends me three different colognes and I like to smell them. I like to blind react to them with you right here. So I take the cards that they send with the colognes and I spray that on the card. And then my studio always smells super baller after like a long time. So this one's called Sugar Leather by Enuit Nomad. It has cinnamon, amorous, leather, caramel, and lard lardanum. Now I already know I'm gonna like this one because it's got leather. Gotta give it a little shaky shake. Ooh, that's good. It's not too overpowering. It's not too heavy. It's very manly. That's something I'd probably wear like a parent teacher conference, right? To work, something like that, going to the store. Mm, that's really, really good. Sugar leather. And it is like, that's it. it. Smells like sugarly leather. I love that one. Next one is called Zaffirano by Aqua de Parma. Aqua de Parma. Mm. Oh, it's already hitting me. That's fruity. Ooh, that's good. That's very European. The last one we have here is called Brit for Men by Burberry. And we know Burberry knows what they're doing, okay? They know their onions. Rose, ginger, tonka bean, nutmeg, and cedar. Ooh, cedar. Oh yeah, that's woody and it's like manly. Like you have to wear a scarf with this one, like a Burberry scarf, a pea coat, mmm, leather gloves. That's what I'm smelling with this one. Like that's Christmas. Guys, get that one. Don't forget they have amazing cases that open. They're good for traveling. You know, you can take your cologne on a plane and not get it taken away by accident. The vial comes in like that. Like again, that much cologne is gonna last you a very long time. Like, and that's why I love it because Scentbird is really cool. If you like a scent that they send you and I'd like to get a little bit more adventurous, I'm going to ask for that same scent again if I if I run out, right? I love that scent and I'm gonna keep it. Or you get a little adventurous and you let Scentbird send you some colognes. And I found some of my most favorite colognes that way. They send me some and I'm like, oh, that's the one, that's the one. And you guys know I love haptics and I love this taste, a little magnet on it. It's just great. And it's got a little locking mechanism. So when you put it in your bag or you put it in your pocket or in your car, whatever, it locks so you can't like accidentally spray, which is like, it's not the worst thing that could happen actually. Scentbird has absolutely reimagined how you smell good. And that's why I love them. Scentbird lets you choose a new designer fragrance every month for $17. You can't go wrong with that. So here's the deal because they hooked me up. I get to hook you up. This is for anybody in your family. This is a perfect stocking stuffer. It's a perfect gift. The gift that keeps on giving. First month, 55% off using my code challenge. Click the link in the description below where my pinned comment takes you right there. Use my code challenge. Don't forget it. 55% off. It's a crazy deal. Every single person in your family needs to get this for Christmas, okay? Everybody, you understand? It's good for bus drivers, for teachers, for bosses. It's a great gift. Like imagine receiving a Scentbird gift and you're like a boss and people giving you lame cards all the time, but you get a Scentbird in a sweet bottle, little bag that they send you, I'm telling you, raise, raise for you. Thank you so much Scentbird for sponsoring this video. Now let's get to it. Welcome to the Dad Challenge Podcast. My name's Josh. Thanks for joining me today on Snark Miss Day something or other. We should do some song sing. We should definitely, maybe I'll do one in this video because we're snarking on Doc and he doesn't. And maybe we need to make a song. On the first day of these nuts, my Doherty gets. So I, need, I think we need to do 12 Days of Christmas on Doc and he doesn't. But not today. We're going to save it for near the end. 
And we're definitely gonna do one. Yeah. Yes. Or we can do like, Hey Lasha, hey Lasha, I wish with all my mind. Something like that. Like we'll write something like that. It'll be fun, right? Hey, anyway, we're she's going to Target. So we gotta talk about how much crap she buys. And it's not even, I'm not even sure it's a Christmas haul yet. She hasn't even done her Christmas shopping, which you know we're gonna do. We're excited to snark on that, right? But before we get started, we gotta spin the old wheel, obviously do a little dreidel song. Someone's gonna win a prize, do a little dance. Let's go. Oh yeah. Come on. Give it to me now. Kiana Klein, you win a prize. Reach out to Josh at thedadchonspodcast.com, either shirt size and your address, and I'm going to hook you up. Let's get to the snark. It's that time of year. DCP is here to snark and to jeer for these buttholes to hear. Don't forget to book your pap smear. Snarkmas 2023. Ho, ho, ho. Now you son of a bitch. All right, Alicia, what are you buying now? Come on now. You don't, you don't need more stuff. Okay? This Christmas, she she, she, she get crazy. Right? She has the opportunity to change. I got a little thing in my glasses here. She's got an opportunity to change, do something crazy outside the box. Everybody, we're waking up. We're going to Disney. All right? We're going on a cruise. We're going to do the same. Why doesn't she do cool stuff? Her vacations are lame. None of it's fun. This family would absolutely enjoy going on a cruise. That would be fun. Like, cruises are good. That's all income. Like, imagine what they'd eat. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, the Dockery doesn't has to have their own cruise ship. That's what I'm saying. So, anyway. Let's see what's going on here at the old Target with the dollar spit! Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Dockerty Dozen. Hey, today. hey! Today we are doing a Target hey, hey, hey. haul for my family of 13. But first... But first, huh. this old ass cup that definitely has Hep C on it. And... Okay, what do we need? French toast sticks? Okay. Iron? Like pills or like to f f to for clothes, you do not need Nutella's, okay? Nor do you need pizza crusts. So basically, it's just shot. It's like just going to the grocery store, but she went to Target instead. That's except like okay, red and green sugar crystals. No, cooking pot. We need any of this stuff. Thank you to everyone who let me know that you can do checklists in the notes app. I oh have my gosh! Thank you, everybody. My thumbs are here. No idea, and it has just made me. So so happy. Well, your thumb is too big and your sausage fingers don't work on it. Can you make this little text bigger? Oh, yeah. You need some hand cream. Like, I'm getting jitters thinking about how dry her hands are, okay? Get some of this stuff. If you have a dude in your life who likes to smell good, not only likes, like, colognes, like Scentbird, but, like, this, Vaseline for men. Ho, oh, not only does it work, Vaseline's the only one that really works for me. Only one I found that works, okay? But because it actually absorbs in your skin, it doesn't. It's not just like, it's not just. I don't know how to explain it. It's not like on the surface, like greasy. I don't know how to explain it. Vaseline actually feels like it's going into your skin, and it smells delectable, okay? I can't do dry hands because it physically makes me. I don't know if it's a sensory thing, but it's like, ugh. <laughs> or like if you have like little. If you've been working outside and your hands are all rough and then you like like a, 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 a fiber cloth or whatever you call those things, like microfiber and your like skin things stick to, oh, I can't, it like, you know what I mean? Ugh, shivers. I have a cow by chocolate milk because we have to go to the oh. local dairy to get that. And I thought it would take you guys along because it's super cute this time of year for the help. No, you don't. You just go get chocolate milk at the store. Holidays. So we'll Plus half your kids are lactose. Well, stop there on the way home it should be a quick haul um yeah the main reason i chose chicks rocking an iphone 14 pro max those target is because uh, my kids just passed around a quick stomach bug and i want to get new toothbrushes and um you don't need new toothbrushes when that happens you could just put them in boiling water for like two seconds that'll be fine but no we have to do some waste we gotta throw some stuff in the garbage 
right? We got to we're we, we got to stick to our climate terrorism task force plan. Right? We are trying to destroy the earth with toothbrushes and dollar store stuff. I don't like the ones Wegmans have. That's silly. They're all the same. As um I like the light up ones so my little kids know how long to brush their teeth for and I think Dumb. Target has them. Plus I'm out of primer. Like what paint? And Dash took my squishy ball thing as a sensory toy. So I <laughs> Murpity murp. Oh, she always does this. She like in her head. She like says like Dash totally stole all their money of our bank account. <laughs> you know? Shut up, Alicia. How did you get fans? <laughs> I need another. Um, I need another. Oh yeah, beauty blender. There, it's not gonna help. Beauty blender. You're welcome. <laughs> It's not gonna help. Bushy ball thing. Oh my gosh. You don't even know it's called a beauty blender, and I do. For shame. I don't know what makeup is. Lash scara, beauty blender. I know what a beauty blender is. Okay? It's because I watch this crap too much. Did you guys know what I meant by squishy ball thing? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we did. You dummy ass. Okay, so, until oh, I can get to Alta, Brie and I keep meaning to do an Alta haul, but. Who's Bri oh. She's so busy with cheerleading, we haven't gotten there, but we will get there soon. Uh, until I can get there, I'm gonna grab it at Target. Let's go. Target, Target. Hey, they got like snow like us. It's all gone now, by the way. Like we got lots of good snow, and then suddenly today, wake up, gone, which is good because I gotta fix my rink, get it ready to be flooded. Man, I'm excited. My kids are so excited for the flood. Tyson. When you come up, man. You, I know you can't skate, but you're gonna have fun skating with me. We're gonna have fun. We're gonna do some fun stuff. Like, does uh, does your girlfriend know how to skate? I don't know. Um, but yeah, we're put, put, putting a rink in the backyard, and I'm so effing excited. Kids are absolutely loving skating right now. Everly likes. Uh, Kathy teaches Everly figure skating. Weston loves to skate. I love that all the kids, neighborhood kids, are gonna come over and skate. It's gonna be like a skating wonderland. I'm gonna put up posts and Christmas lights all around it. It's gonna look so sick. Man, I love living. Okay, can't come into a It's a big rink. Okay, it's huge. Target without looking at the dollar. Dollar spot. Dollar spot. Dollar spot. Do you guys know where that came from? Who was I making fun of that kept calling it the dollar spot? Was that, was that Bits of Bish? We haven't done a video on Bits of Bish. Should we bring Bits of Bish back for Snarkmas? What has she been up to? I don't even know. Didn't she get remarried or something? What is going on with Bits of Bish? Yeah, we're doing that. If you didn't know this, like this is bits of bish. Aloha pineapple! That's and I have a pineapple, literally a pineapple. That's from that era. That's from the bits of bish era. That's crazy. Where is it? Where's my pineapple? Over. Those are I'm they're not. They're red mittens. One of those mittens would fit your thumb. Burn. So Do you never go home ever? Are you? Sh I pretty much think sh I think she shops four times, five times a week. That's all she does. Four to five times a week she's shopping. I can't wait. Like the, pr the people that are helping me compile the list of what she's purchased, I cannot wait to get it. It's gonna be like Christmas. We're gonna do it in the new year. We're gonna compile it all. I I can't wait to see what she has spent. And I I wonder if the IRS knows. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's only a dollar. Dollar. This would be like a really nice gift bag. You're a gift bag to Satan. Oh my gosh, she's got popcorn containers. You do not need those. Walk on by the Dallas pit. We need new popcorn containers. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Get lost. Put them back. Put them back. Two. Four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Like seriously. Oh, okay. Shut up. Maybe it's fate, like Jess fam's fate. It's fate. There's an angel watching over you for your plastic waste. The angel of plastic waste. Extra in case there's a friend over. How cute are these? They're not cute. They're garbage. You think your kids need that little bit of popcorn? 
He had a set of these from the back. refill that 40 times before they're done. Uh, sure. For forever. And they just got like, just used so much that. So all you feed, all you feed your kids is crap. We know. We know. Um, yeah. We know. Get rid of them. Anyways, I've been meaning to replace them ever since. Shut up. Let's get a grab a cart. Cart win! I, I've been Target a couple times. They have good carts. Like, they're legit. Some of them have, like, cup holders and have phone holders. Like, <laughs> like they're they smooth. It's like they have disc brakes on them, I think. They're nice. Like, blinkers. I also wanted to come to Target because... See, it's whatever's on the list, and she's always like, okay, I'm here, I'm gonna also gonna buy a million other things that are on my list. I also need this. And my kids are obsessed with this one candy, and they ate it all, so I gotta buy 400 more of them. I saw a video that they have matching women's and dogs' sweaters. I don't know if that was a lie or not, but we're gonna check it out. I got one of those for somebody in my family. I'm not gonna say who, just in case they're watching this. But it is cute. But it's for the cat. Damn. That's gonna really narrow it down. Shirt. Oh, that's so cute. Shut up. Get wrecked. Okay. Okay. I also needed to get Brie boots still. No, you bought them all boots, liar. Other ones I got her didn't fit. Oh, okay. I'll allow it then. They didn't fit like I hope you took them back and just throw them in the garbage or something. And yeah, it looks like these. Okay. These are ugly. These are butt ugly. Okay. Okay, time to focus. Yeah, she's not even she's like ten minutes in the video and hasn't even started on her list yet. Okay, the other reason I came to Target is to see if I can find any last minute stuff. No, last stuff. minute murping murps. Because I'm going to put their stuff. Wait, did someone put their like empty coffee on the shelf? Get wrecked. Things together this week. I have like, I think enough, but sometimes Target has really cute things. Like what? You don't need candy. Get lost. You don't need any candy. None. Gosh, they Holy, they picked that through. Picked over already. Picked over is what I meant to say. December, Dang it, I said it wrong. December 7th. Okay. Maybe look at another. Ta targets, like, like the, all the targets I've ever been to, judging for Halloween and Christmas stuff, like, that happens. They don't clean their shelves there. Isn't it weird? It's, like, supposed to be the high-end Walmart, but they just leave, just let people decimate areas of it and just, like, leave it like that. That's weird. Wow, it's so I quiet in there. Have procrastinated. What do you need? What could you possibly need here? You don't need anything. You have enough junk food at your house to kill a small army. Okay? Stop it! You do not need more candy canes, that's for sure. You have like 8,000 candy canes in your tree. You're probably all gone already. This is crazy. Clean your shelves, Target. Okay, I did need sugar crystals. That is on my list. Um, no, red number 40 sugar crystals. Cancer in a jar. Is he red? Oh, here. Oh, this will be perfect. Don't this do it. This is exactly what I need for some cookies I'm making. Excellent. I can't wait to see those cookies. Remember her Christmas cake? She just did all the crap. Oh, I had so many people reach out to me who are, are good at baking, and they're like, they were so appalled. They were offended. They literally took offense. And they should. Because the, that cake was a monstrosity. You should put in prison for that kind of like, thing. There's no, there's no reason to continue on after that. Like, get wrecked. Oh, new merch in the new year, get wrecked. Maybe I'll do a little thing, what you guys think I should make. Because I'm always gonna keep the I Love Dad Bod shirts because those are like classic, right? The Chachi, I think I'm gonna get rid of, I haven't said Chachi in a long time, doesn't, eh. You know, I love I Love Dad Bods, I'm gonna do Nana use SOB, that's good merch, we're gonna keep that, but not with the old lady, we're gonna keep it just like the hat, keep it nice. I wanna have shirts and stuff that you can like wear anywhere, and people are like, it starts the conversation, right? So let me know what you think we should do for shirts. Used chocolate milk there. Used chocolate okay. milk. Perfect. 
some Christmas cookies I want to make. You're a Christmas cookie. Bad one though. Well, like a, a um, gross yes. Christmas cookie. Like a cookie made of coal. Stop. Actually, those are nice. <laughs> so cute. This do smell though. You know. Okay, so what we got? Oops, I did not mean to check that. Okay, so we got the red and green sugar crystals. Wow. One thing on your list. Wait, how long we in this video? Six minutes. One thing we got. Nice. Ew, someone coughed with their mouth open. You can get like... Why? Why do you need it? Yes. So put in your stockings. Stockings. Okay, there's 20 in a bag. You have 10 kids. Right, 11 kids. That's all you need. So it's like, okay, so each kid's getting 15 suckers. Okay, cool. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Is there anybody here? Target looks empty. Crazy. Actually, I've I've been to Target like maybe like let's say five times my entire life. Okay. Also, every time I've been there, it doesn't, it's never busy. Like, do you guys ever go and it's like so busy? Is, there, is that just me? Is it just the way it is? Is that way people go there? I'll get that for Harley's stocking. Okay. I put in. She went back to wearing the eyeliner, the Marilyn Manson eyeliner. I don't know why. Something happened. Maybe it's when she had too many white claws the day before. Ornament in their stocking area. Okay. Ooh, that's cool. What? Oh, yeah! More like, oh, no, don't feed me to your kids. My son would love that right there. We don't have that. You guys remember the, uh, what are those things called? The books of... Holy lifesavers. Do you remember the old school books of lifesavers? Do they still have those? Because I can't find them anywhere where I am. If you guys have them locally, let me know. I'll come home and get some. Like, I want to get like the nostalgia of that. But my like the little booklet things, those are things are awesome. Does anybody else do this for kids' stockings? It's like the stocking gets full up and then it's like you have an extra box full of stuff. Like the our kids' stockings are like ridiculous. Okay. And that's it's because we because Santa comes to our house. I don't know if he does it for everybody else. I think it's because maybe I had this when I was a kid when Santa just has followed me forever and just liked what we did. But we, but Santa puts our stockings outside of our door. So when we wake up at 2 o'clock in the morning because we're excited, we got something to open up for a couple hours. So thanks, Santa. He always knows. Santa always knows. There's only three of them, so you can't get those. Let's see. I found four. Mm, nobody likes candy necklaces, okay? It's just they don't. Because I like them. Because you like them or your kids do? Who's putting Tostitos and salsa back where the candy is? Oh, there they are. Okay. Get a whole box! Those are dumb. Two, three, four. Seven, you don't have to do it one at a time. You know that we're pulling your hand. Nine, ten, eleven. Okay. Oh, these are cute. What are they? Mints? Snowman. Penguin. What are they? Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Holy crap, lady. Your kids eat Mentos? The little ones do? Don't think that, uh, does anybody else's kids think that, like, mint is spicy? So you have ten. Oh. So some get the toothpaste ones, some don't. Cool. Delicious. Is this on her list? 
You boner. Oh, angry. Holy, keep it down, lady! Stop screaming with the bags! Ugh. Okay, you already know you have 11. You already know. I think she thinks she's doing ASMR. This is gonna cause people hearing damage. This isn't relaxing ASMR. This is like aggressive ASMR, like metal ASMR. Metal core ASMR. Let's look at more ornaments. It's gonna be or There's like six left. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's why you gotta go to that place in Michigan, uh, Bronner's. That place, that place is like, like Christmas barfed. And it is amazing. I want to go back so bad. You're balls at this shopping thing. Still, I think she's checked off one thing on her list. One thing. Wow, none of these are good. Okay. Here we go. All the Hallmark seen ones. too much. I like to really get it personalized to something they're really into that year. So. <laughs> but they don't have cereal and sugar and red dye number 40 is a Christmas ornament. They're not really into normal things, but like sugar. Do they have one that's just pure mac and cheese? We're gonna have to go to a different store for the ornaments. They have a Velveeta ornament. Just the ornaments. All right, the last thing I want- Is there a snackerty board? Is there a shark board ornament? This section are some gift tags. Sucks. I might have to go to Michael's for what I'm looking for. Those are cute. No, they're not. Gosh, that's so pretty. No, it's not. That's ugly. Love it. It's not good. Okay, next aisle. Mm, yeah, I'm not seeing what I want. Okay. Oh my gosh. I watched Miracle on 34th Street for the first time last night. Like the updated version of John Hughes. John, nobody comes close. Well, a couple do. But John Hughes Christmas movies are amazing. Like he just knew how to do it. What is with the 90s and like really nice overcoats, leather gloves, New York City? Like let's bring that back. Let's go there. I'm going to take my family to New York City next Christmas. Like... For the Macy's Day Parade, some shopping, like do all the fun stuff. Like there's skating. My like I've been in New York a couple times. My wife has been, but like we're gonna go see a Broadway show. Like I'm because of that movie, I'm literally gonna go take my kids to like Macy's to see Santa. And so I was like, it's gonna be awesome. What a good movie! I felt good. I had never seen it. I didn't like. I don't like watching the old ones. I thought I didn't, but I do like them. So Kathy wants me to watch the old ones, like uh, White Christmas. Um, with the, I think Frank Sinatra's in that one actually. So I'm, I'm down. This year's gonna be like the, it's the era of old Christmas movies mixed with my, my staples. So it was good. It's a good movie. It made me feel really good. Like when he starts speaking sign language to the little girl, and the little girl from um, Mrs. Doubtfire, she's so cute the way she talks. Like that movie was feel good. And like I felt good after the lighting of like the way they did their eyes and stuff. He's so good. Anyway, go watch it if you haven't seen it. Actually. Hey, hey, Satan. Hey, Lasha. Hey, Lasha. I wish with all my mind you'd stop, you'd stop exploding your effing kid. I'm gonna, should I do that song? I should do that song. Oh, Lash. You buy too much garbage for your kids I don't know how they even wake up So much red dot number 40 in their cup What's wrong with you? Oh, Lasha you're only halfway through this video And you've only checked off one thing from your list Nobody likes you, the floor smells like piss Full fries and a 
apple pies and sugar in your eyes. Yeah, yeah, it's Christmas at the Dockery Dozen house with a bunch of flies. That's stupid. That's the worst song I ever wrote. But still decent. Hey, Sienna. What do you mean? Four the present ones. And I'll use the other ones for other things. You're dumb. And the present ones for what? What did I miss? There's more gift wrap stuff over here. You're, you're in gift wrap. Let's see if I like anything better. But in the gift, it's something bad. Holy smokes, Alicia, this is terrible. Penguin. My favorite animal. Okay. Since when are penguins your favorite animal? I mean, she walks like a penguin, so. Burn. I know. I like the present the best. Oops. Okay. Get some chips! Don't forget the pirate's booty, bum hole, butthole, thingies. Pirate's booty hole. Like, it's so specific. I absolutely need more smart food, even though there's a hundred bags of chips at home. Weird. Because some kid just recently is like, I like this, and then they ate them all. That's what happened. Then she's going to buy them 40 bags of it. It's, everything, it's all the time, but she does. I needed veggie straws too, but I ordered those on Amazon. Why? 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 Yeah. Dude, why did you tell us? They're out of Sunny D. The twins are back into Sunny D again. Well, is the advertising coming in for it too? Back in Sunny D. Like, isn't that crazy to say? Like, the kids got so sick of all the sugar they were drinking that they stopped for a while. And now it's been a little while, so their bodies have recovered. It's like, we need more Sunny D! <laughs> it's crazy. Sunny D is, like, good once a every millennia. Right? You're like, it's super hot outside. The only thing left is Sunny D and you need some ice in there. It's not bad. Right? But the amount of Sunny... Like, Sunny D is the Velveeta of orange juice. And I'm going to stand by this. Velveeta mac and cheese is not good. So I don't know what you guys are drinking over there or smoking... But it is not good. It's flavorless, gross. So I don't care what you say, who comes for me. Velveeta is nasty. Nasty. So better get 30 of them. Better believe that's not even it. See? The second check mark on this thing. Celery. <laughs> Celery's on the list. I am <laughs> so glad this is on an end cap because. It's not even on your list. No, she just bought that. And I know because she showed it. Are you telling us your kids downed all that chocolate syrup you bought? And if so, call the police. I've been using it to make chocolate milk because we ran out of chocolate milk. Oh, darker, darker. Okay, I'm looking for the Jolly. Oh. There Who's, who's currently obsessed? You're going to tell us someone is currently obsessed with these right now? I love these. Oh my gosh, look at the Christmas sweater Nutella. Shut up. That's so cute. I'd actually wear that sweater. Get them all. I'll take everything so no one else can have some. And Dash pack this in their snack for school. You're not allowed to bring nuts to school. If I sent that to my kid's school, I'd be arrested. She keeps doing this. You're not supposed to send nuts to school. And she even admitted it. It's Nutella, not Nutella, by the way. And if you say Nutella, we can't be friends. It's hazelnuts, not hazelnuts, okay? It's like yop. It's not yop, and I don't care what the marketing agency or what the name, whoever invented it, what they call it. It's yogurt. It's yo plate, yo play or whatever. It's not yop, okay? It's like when people pronounce GIF, GIF, graphics interchange format, not graphics. I'm just, I'm over it, okay? I don't care who, I don't care who the inventor was of it. They're wrong. Like, who invents a GIF and calls it a GIF? 
Nerds? Okay, I need pizza crust. Okay, I'll show you. What should we get? What should we get? Is this? Bird? Did I get 40 of them? Four, six, eight. I was kidding. You need 10 pizza crusts for a family of 13? Why? Is everybody eating a pizza? You need four, maximum. 14. You need 14 pizza crusts. What for what? What do you mean? What are you doing 14 pizza crusts? How do you even make 14 pizza? What? Pizza what? Sauce. That's not pizza sauce, that's spaghetti sauce. Okay, yeah, three of those. 14 pizza for us. Again, for what? Grab some sliced olives for you make your own pizza night. Yeah, you can make your own pizza on a slice of bread or a pita. You don't need each kid to have their own giant pizza. What are you, what's wrong with you? Like reaching through. <laughs> dirt, 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 dirt. Well, let's see if they have French toast sticks because Walmart didn't and Wegmans. I just didn't like the boxes, but I really like the giant bags of them. What is a cinnamon toast stick and how do you make it? Is it good? It's like a churro? I don't see any waffles. Man, those churros I had in California to this day live rent free in my brain. Like the. Elodi, he totally. What's it called? The the corn. Elodi. Dang, I already forgot. Pancakes, crustables. We are all the French toast sticks. You're a French toast stick. Okay, so we got. Holy pizza. cow! Look at this. A pizza crust. Show sticks we can't find. Um, I gotta get peppers for the sloppy joes. Peppers and celery for the sloppy joes tonight, and then. You ever heard of Manwich? Good. Manwich is good. Stuff. Bad for you, but good. Interesting. I don't think they carry the dairy chocolate milk you got Target. No, I think just Wegmans. Or you could just stop feeding your kid chocolate milk for a little while. It's a suggestion. Sorry, my bad. Just a suggestion! Okay. Oh, I gotta get cream cheese. Oh, it's not in your list. Most of the things she has in her cart right now, none of it's on her list. Bagels. Like three now. things. I used the cream cheese for um, the raspberry danish recipe. I'm sure it was delicious, not burnt. What should I get? What should I get? Walk around the phone, <laughs> and you have another phone in front of you. Like you care. No one's eating the peppers. Holy smokes! I saw the celery down there. Isn't yes. that what it is? Yeah. Yes. Exactly where I was looking. Excellent. What's that on the... You never know what Target, like, what produce you'll find. Why did you go there for produce then? She always says, like, I didn't like the way the peppers looked at Walmart. But you go to Wegmans. And Wegmans has all the fresh stuff. Like, uh, Right? Okay, that will just keep searching. You know, BJ's might have French toast sticks. Might be a random thing. Yeah. Okay. Um, over to the toiletry section. Mm-hmm. to get some regular band-aids considering I'm currently using 
kid band aids. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Uh, anyone else? I just want like normal, like just a normal band aid. I, I don't know. Is this normal? You're, I mean, you don't know what normal is. Okay. You think normal is feeding your kids literally junk food their entire lives. That's what you think normal is. I guess it's better than like. Of all the things that Lish has changed on her channel that we've called her out for, drinking is one of them. Although she just keeps it hidden now. She doesn't openly do it like she's flexing, like she drinks White Claws. A um, couple things. She maybe now she started like cleaning the knife in between cutting sandwiches. It's a bunch of things she has changed. She doesn't wear her, her ripped up jeans anymore, which is great. The one thing she doesn't change, though, is the one thing that matters the most is feeding her kids healthy food. Not once. Like, not even one day it's, like, healthy food. Not even once has there ever been something healthy where she's like, this is one. It's always been garbage. She never has changed this. Interesting. I'm going to go to the pharmacy real quick and get more Claritin-D for my allergies. Okay, thanks for telling us. Okay, yeah, Claritin-D. Hopefully they carry my iron here. Hopefully they are ironing in here. My shirt's uh, got some stuff on it. It's got, it's got, what do you call that when you iron out? Wrinkles! Dang it! Okay, might be stopping at Walgreens for that. Mm hmm. Or you could have gotten all this stuff at Walgreens. Okay, let's make a pit stop at Walgreens on the way. Okay, I gotta get your peppers there too. What's with the the eyeliner? You look like you're from the pits of hell. Because you are. I have another giant cooking pot. I know Walmart has it, and I totally forgot to get it there. Um, because we have one. But you're not in the pot section. It's just times where we need two, like when I have sauce cooking in one, and then when I want to make up spaghetti in another one. Yeah, they don't have the giant one I want here. Okay. <laughs> Okay, even their toothbrushes are wiped out. <laughs> What's going on? Shut up. Okay. Um, There's tons of toothbrushes. Are we looking at the same spot? Let's see. Tons. I'll go to Walgreens. Okay. 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 Or get them the ones from Costco that have like the, the water pick in them um, and everything else. So you can just pop off the tip and put a new tip on. No, the amount of crap they waste with batteries is insane. I've been covering her for a, like a year or over a year now. And the amount of toothbrushes she's bought has been astounding. Astounding. So each of my kids has a specific color toothbrush just to keep it all straight. So like Deshaun's always blue. That's stupid. And There's not even 11 colors of toothbrushes. So how do you do that? This is black. Brie is usually pink, but purple will work. So too. it's not the same color. So what are you, you're, you're already messed up. So what's the point? What's the point of doing it? And then... Okay, what other colors? What other colors? They usually get green. And Zoe is red, but they are picked okay, over. Okay, that's... Five colors max. Where are the other colors coming from? Um, mm -hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah. Holy cow. Just the tooth part. Okay, yeah, yeah, off. Brushes. Okay. Kids. Oh, shoot. Oh, yes. Okay. Here we go. This is what I get for the little kids. It lights up the entire time they brush their teeth and then they know how long to brush their teeth for. Okay, so Jason is green, um, Jordan is blue. You're just making this up. Dash is red. No, I'm sorry. Bodie is red. Okay, and then you just bought an extra blue one. Who's the blue one for? Charlie is pink. And then- While I'm here, I'm going to get a second set of these. Because I can't, like, I can get the big kids' toothbrushes at pretty much any store, but these I can't find everywhere. You just find them now. Get them on Amazon. Holy crap, lady. And then we're prepared. For, for what? Prepared for what? The Cold War? 
What are you doing? Well, it's, it's like she was something nefarious with these toothbrushes. Like she's selling them on the black market or something. I also have to get my white and toothpaste because now Alex started using this, so we're going through it faster with, you know, one more person using it. Anyway, so I'll grab this while I'm at it. Elf on the shelf. There. Elf. This one. What is it? Tone adjusting face primer. You definitely need tone adjusting, so get, get two of those. And get three of those. Beauty blenders. I mean, it depends on who's using it, whether or not it can be called a beauty blender, okay? For her, it's just called a makeup blender. A uh, barf blender. <laughs> Okay, I just randomly need envelopes. You what? No, you don't. For what? You send it. No, you don't. You know, she buys envelopes and then she loses them. That's what. And she needs one, and it's just boxes of envelopes all over her house. Hundred and fifty envelopes for what? Who do you send letters to? Let's go check out. Seven. Six. Three hundred dollars. I got a $10 promotional gift card. Go to the That's bottom. $450 for a mini Target haul. Dang, man. Thanks for showing this to us. Here's the thing. If she ever gets audited by the IRS for misspending, because she probably just thinks she can write this off and she can't, like, she's toast. She's putting this on the internet. I'm downloading every single one of them. So, <laughs> you idiot. You idiot. Electronics. And she even shows the credit card number that she uses in this thing. You only see the last four digits. But even the IRS will be like, well, that seems like your business credit card. And it looks like you're buying all this stuff with business money. What's on my buy electronics? Huh. You don't even know and you're not even going to check and you don't even care? I mean, I'll take it. I don't know what it was for. <laughs> I asked the cashier if she had seen the matching dog and women's sweaters, and she has not. So now I need to know what magical target these are at. Are oh, you don't. Okay, I just pulled into the dairy. I gotta show you. The dairy. Thank you. Dairy. I gotta bring my kids by too. We haven't been here yet. This just one. Okay. All right, so this is the outside. It's like a little Christmas tree stand. Mm-hmm. And there's the front of the dairy. Pittsford Firms Dairy. Like you get like milk right from the cows. Homemade wreaths. Okay, don't buy stuff you don't need. Oh, look at this bear. Oh my gosh, it just smells amazing here. I wish you could smell it. it smells like wood. Look at that moose. Looks like a Twinkie with antlers. Look at the reindeer. Looks like a ring gear. And the best part is what? The milk? They're like, oh my gosh, the lady that feeds her kids so much sugar. Yeah, don't look at her, 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 don't look up, don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look. Don't look, don't look, don't look. Oh, you're fighting. I want a cow. I would love to have a small farm with just but just a bunch of animals, like a hobby farm. Oh my gosh, that would be so. I love animals. I think Sam is sad. Kathy made me cry today. She's like, because Sam, he's acting a little abnormal. Because obviously, and I didn't realize this, because he's lost his best friend of 15 years. 
Sam has had has had macaroni around for 15 years in his life. That hit me really hard, man. Sometimes there's a dog here too. Not today. Well, this one's going. It's a pretty cool fire pit, though. I'm not gonna lie. All right, where's the milk? Take little pictures there. All right, let's go get that kid's favorite chocolate milk. And we'll spend $80 on it. Grab something for dessert tonight. I'm sure you will. You know you don't have to eat dessert every day, right? That's like can be a special thing, like weekends. Like, you know that, right? I just want to know if you knew that. This is where we come for ice cream in the summer sometimes, too. Here's your thumb. Ice cream pie. It's got mint on it, so no. Oh my gosh. Ew, no. Peppermint chocolate, no, no. Peppermint no. chocolate fudge pie. Put some hand cream on too. It's yeah. making me uncomfortable. I'm getting, I'm having a visceral reaction looking at your dry ass hands. Ugh. We're getting that for dessert, and look at there's a red. Milk. You need two of those for desserts. Raspberry. We've had, the, we've had this one. Do not need two giant pies for normal dessert on a normal night. Uh, the peppermint one. So I'm gonna get that for dessert tonight. Just the one. Which means I need two of them. No, you do not need two of them. Uh, one is just not for yes, it is. And if it's not, go get something else. This looks amazing. It's gross. It's got peppermint in it. You don't buy any of this stuff. I left my one at home. So buy another one of these carriers. <laughs> Such a loser! Such a loser! Thank you. That's probably forty dollars worth of chocolate milk right there. Came in with it. Three chocolate milks, fifteen dollars. So it's thirty-five. I was close. The bottle deposit six to forty. I'm right on forty-one bucks, and then a carrier ten bucks. What about the pies? Two ice cream pies, sixty dollars for ice cream pie. All right, we got the three milks, the two pies, and the pies. Okay, there's the pies. Wow, you're what a dumb. There's our Target and Dairy Hall. Your kids can't even drink that. They're lactose. Garbage, of course. Why does she always show her dry ass hands? All right, I'm going across the street to get gas. You drink some of that milk, you get some gas. 379, that's pretty good, right? That's pretty good. So, oh, you got cheaper than ours. Holy smokes, only a buck 36 a liter. Dang, man. Right now, it's like a buck 60 a liter where I am. So, like, my gas right now in America. Would be like, let's just to keep it simple, four dollars and thirty-four cents in America per gallon. Right now, we're two hundred dollars back on select sets of four liter tires. Two hundred dollars back on select sets of four liter tires. She putting medium grade in there. Why? Not bad, man. Ninety bucks for that tank with with semi premium gas. Ew, gross. Dang. I keep hand sanitizer like right in the. And the sound of the skin rubbing together, it's all dry. <laughs> no, you know? Over here and I just use it every time I get it. Mm. Alright, I just pulled in my driveway, so I'm gonna let you go. But no, I don't care what you know. Get lost. No one likes you. Wow, those balls. So she had like a bunch of stuff on her list, didn't get a lot of it on the list, but then bought like $450 worth of stuff, then 90, so she bought $550 worth of stuff for a tiny little haul for the afternoon. 
All this woman does is shop. I cannot wait to compile how much she spent from last Christmas to this Christmas. Like, get ready. Wait till this Christmas shopping. How is she going to top last year? What's she going to do? I'm so excited and nervous to figure out what she's going to get. We're all excited. We're all waiting for it. So, everybody take a deep breath. I love it. You guys are awesome. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having some fun with me. Thanks for laughing. Thanks for just being incredible and valuable. Don't you forget it. I will see you when I see you. Filthy animals. It's that time of year. DCP is here to snark and to jeer for these buttholes to hear. Don't forget to book your pap smear. Snarkmas 2023. Ho, ho, ho. Now you son of a bitch.